Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we're taking a look at a couple of interesting things that folks at Epic Games have announced for Unreal Engine and they include the 500 free animations that you can simply go ahead and get right now and this isn't the only thing that you can get. They are also announcing content examples. Now these content examples are also available for those who like to explore the contents that are currently available and some of this has to do with Unreal Engine Motion Graphics UI, skin rendering and also subsurface materials. These examples are currently available for free and for those who like to grab them you can simply go over to the marketplace and get this right now. The content examples alongside the game animation sample which is offering 500 plus triple A high quality animations are right here. Now before we talk about what you can get with this and also some of the cool things that this actually comes with, let's also talk about a couple of other places where you can get high quality animations as this is offering 500 plus. Let's take a look at places you can get even more. So if you simply go over to Rococo, they are also offering a ton of this. Now I have no idea how many people know about this one, but if you simply go over to the resource section of Rococo, you'll be able to get all of these motions and you can work with them alongside Unreal Engine. So if you're looking for gun animations, superhero animations, or maybe you're looking for some street fighting animations, all of these have been fully captured for you. So you don't necessarily need to redo them and you can go ahead and grab it. Now, this is one place you can find tons of free stuff for you to get this from Rococo, you need to have an account and that's basically the only thing you need and from here you'll be getting the FBX and you can simply go ahead and work with it. Some other guys that are also giving out stuff are the folks at Bydam Namco. So we've already talked about these folks before, they're offering a huge set of assets that you can work with which ranges across 17 different types of animations that has to do with daily activities, fighting, dancing, you know, all of that stuff you can get it. The folks at CG Speed also have a huge set of animation. Currently, this is about 2,500 motion capture data that you can work with. So if you're working with Unreal Engine, they might want to get the motion builder friendly version, which has to do with FBX files. And you can tell that this is quite a lot. So in case you like to get any of these ones, it's available. Actor Core is also another place that you can get about 32 different animations that you can simply pick up. They are totally for free. And of course, Mixamo is also one of the places you can get free stuff. Now, cycling back all the way to the folks at Epic Games Unreal Engine, you can also get all of these by simply going over to the marketplace. So if you go over to the marketplace right now, you'll be able to download this. And this is currently available for those working with Unreal Engine 5.4 and above. And how this one works is extremely easy. Now we already talked about how you can do some stuff, which includes rigging in Unreal Engine. And for those who like to see how you can do some retargeting and stuff like that, or maybe the motion matching, which is powering what we're going to be taking a look at, you can also put that in the comment section and we'll probably make a video for you guys. So if we simply fire up Unreal Engine, what we get is this. So it's pretty simple how you can work with this. If you have a game controller, you can also work with this as well. So for us to start seeing what we can do, all we need to do is press the playback button and we can start seeing it. I'm just going to go ahead and move all this away. I'm also going to bring this all the way down. And when we start moving, see what happens. So there's a couple of menus that exist here. Let's talk about them real quick. So these menus, they deal with the style. So we have the default color style or the colorful one. Then we have the light and the dark one. Dark one looks cool. And if you simply go all the way to the first one, it takes you to the obstacle course and we can go ahead and jump through it. And you can also go ahead and climb. And we're just simply going to run all the way through to where we can find something else so we are right here in obstacle number three that is quite an interesting one and you get to see all these obstacles and you can play with them now for the characters how you work with the characters are pretty interesting so right here we've got different you know menus i would say and these menus they get to control some stuff the very first one has to do with game widgets and the game animation widget which we're going to take a look at and we've also got the controllers so if you want to see what controls you need to press to get some actions going, depending on what you're working with, right now we're working with a keyboard and a mouse. And, you know, if you're working with a controller, you can also go ahead and see these ones too. So I'm simply going to close that. And now let's take a look at the characters that we can play with. So we're simply going to go over to the character section. And from here, we can see the characters that are currently available. We can toggle through these characters and preview them looking good we can preview them and we can also select different characters we want so depending on what you want to get going you do have options for that so in this case i can also switch over to as many of them that i think i think we should actually explore with this other one there's uh something that is pretty cool actually let's do that so there's this thing which is pretty cool which i think i should show you guys so if you have all three of them and you get them animating 
see what happens. It's the middle one that actually gets the job done. So when we go over here and we press the control, you can see that, you can see all of this. So it's doing a very nice motion matching, but I would definitely say, you know, if you like to do this or probably you like to work with it, then of course, even if you have about three different characters, the middle character is the only character that has the major thing that you're looking for. So let's go ahead and change this to something more interesting. And right here, I'm going to get this or probably Echo. Echo seems to be a very good character. Let's go ahead and close that out and we can have it. So it, it is pretty interesting to see that the whole real time motion matching thing is now available with uh, Unreal Engine. And for those who like to you know, explore that. Let's go ahead and climb that real quick. Yeah, for those who like to explore this, you can go ahead and see it. Now for the content browser, there's a few things that you might want to see, and this has to do with the characters. So all of the characters that we just worked with, you can find them here. If you go over to Echo, you can see the mesh, you can see the rig, in case you want to use them for your own project. If you also go over to the input section, you can also see some of the input actions that are available right here. We've also got some blueprints that are also available right here for those who like to play with them. And right over here, we've got the widget. And of course, we also have the animation, which you'll be able to find right here. So if we go over to the UEFN, we, if we go all the way into animation, we get them. So these are the animations that we have and you can see all of them. And for those who like to do some retargeting, of course, you can simply have those animations and you can simply go over to your animation, you know, use the retargeter or the IK re to actually retarget these animations to your custom model. So these are currently available. And for anyone who likes to check them out, then you can simply go over to the link in the description and see it. While we talk about things that has to do with Unreal Engine that you can get, the folks at Humble Bundle, they also have this cool stuff, which is currently running. Now, I don't know if you've missed it or if you've seen it, but this is the Epic Environment Mega Bundle. This is both for Unreal Engine and Unity, and it comes with over 2,300 assets. All of these is priced about 1,100 and eight euro but you'll be paying less than 25 euros to get all of them these are amazing stuff for those who like to create some interesting environments in unreal engine and possibly if you like to get some custom characters that you can use alongside these free animation sets that i've already talked about then you might want to go ahead and see this for yourself so this is it for those who like to get all of this you can simply go ahead and grab it right now as this is running out so just in case you like to get it this might be a wonderful opportunity for you to do it and for those who like to explore all of this and probably see the content examples which has also been released alongside this beautiful stuff from the folks at epic games then you can simply go over to the link in the description and see this for yourself tell me what you guys think about this one in the comment section and of course if you like this video or you like something from this you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend and until i see you guys in the next one peace